and to help ameliorate the suffering of Bielsons owing to the high cost of living in the country. Subunions under the auspices of the Iowa Traders Association in Bielsa say they are in support of the resolution by its parent body, calling on the state government to provide a land for traders of the group to cultivate crops. They gave their support in Yenagua after a general meeting. The subgroups were the Yam Dealers Association, Rice and Bean Sellers Association, Farmers Union Association, Vegetable and Pepper Dealers Association, and others. According to the group, the initiative will help regulate the price of commodities, as they are also in talks with their members in the North, saying that the demand of goods is more than the supply, which is also affecting the price of commodities in the markets. The uh, subunions, they assure us that they will buy in our course and they will support us to see how we can regulate the price or how we can take the price down. The modalities, when there is the law of demand and supply, when there is demand, when the supply is so low, the price definitely will go up. I appreciate the, the consideration that the government is giving to us as in traders and the security we have to trade in the states. Definitely, Basa State Government and the Prosperity Governor, he is with us all the time and with, with him too. We want to see our contribution with the collaboration of this president unit that we, we, we created so that we see there's no problem in bringing food here in Baelsa and other material here in Baelsa. Not only scrap is our business in this Baelsa, even them, those who are into the trade uh, business is not only trade. Before we learn how to do trade or scrap, we are already farmers. So because of that, we say, okay, let us come make a production into a larger scale uh, distant production so that we should make a distant, we should do the thing that will make the Baelsa people to proud of us.